Good morning, YouTube. Today I am coming at you live from my apartment kitchen. It is my first day of class for the summer. I'm taking a 12 hour course load over the summer and I'll be finishing up my junior classes in electrical engineering. And food is important and it's good to start the day off with a nice breakfast. So today I'll be showing you everything that I will be eating, which is a lot. I hope you enjoy. I start off every morning with some coffee so I have that made and now I'm gonna heat up the pan and put on some coconut oil spray from Trader Joe's and we're gonna be having scrambled eggs and toast with some peanut butter some blueberries and some orange juice I scramble three eggs usually I find that that's enough to keep me satisfied Another thing I want to point out is that some people think that eating the whole egg isn't good for you and I know a lot of people stick to egg whites just for the protein, but I believe it's important to get the yolk in too because most of the nutrients and vitamins in the egg are actually found in the yolk. Also in terms of my diet, I actually do not track my calories or count my macros or anything like that. But for the sake of this video, I went back and calculated all the calories and fats and proteins and carbs and everything because I know that might be helpful for some of you watching. This would have to be the favorite item for me for this whole breakfast. I can't get enough of the Trader Joe's peanut butter with flax and chia seeds and also the flax and chia it gives you a lot of healthy fat and makes your breakfast more filling. So after that I'm just going to add some blueberries, pour a glass of orange juice, and pour a glass of coffee and that is the finished breakfast. So it's roughly three hours since I've had breakfast and I just had my first class. It was from 9 to 10.50 and it was electromagnetism for wireless communications. So after all that I am really hungry and I'm ready for a snack. I will be making a protein shake. Here's all the ingredients for the protein shake. It's a fairly high carb, high protein shake. It's also low fat and I really enjoy this. I'm going to start with a frozen banana and I'm going to break that up to kind of help the blending process. I'm going to add in a cup of reduced fat milk. And then I'll be throwing in some blueberries, some honey, and a scoop of protein. The protein I'm adding in is the IntraCore Vanilla Whey Protein. I've got this one off Amazon and I really enjoy it because it only has a few ingredients. I've been trying to eat a lot of cleaner items and I noticed that some proteins, like for example the one you can see in the background, the Gold Standard Optimum Nutrition, it has a lot of unnecessary additives. So here's the finished shake and next we will be eating lunch. About a few hours after I had my shake, I was ready for lunch, so I'm taking the Dave's Killer Everything Bagel, and I really like these bagels because you get a lot of nice carbs from the whole grains, and you also get 12 grams of protein, and I am taking my bagels and I'm spreading them with a reduced fat Philadelphia cream cheese. 
Also, I want to give 100% of this lunch idea to Jasmine Garcia because I found this on her What I Eat in a Day video, I decided to try it out, and I absolutely love this lunch. When I'm in school, I like eating my lunch about one to two hours before the gym because for me, I find it really important to have all the fuel my body needs to push through a workout. Next, I'll be adding uh, roughly three slices of turkey breast on top of the cream cheese, and then I'll be topping that off with spinach, and that's all for the sandwich. And then on the side, I like to have some baby carrots just to get extra vegetables in. I just hit a squat workout and big surprise I am hungry again so now I will be just having a snack because it's about 5 30 and I don't like eating my dinner this early so I'm just gonna carb up really quickly and eat enough so that I am fine until dinner On to the final meal of the day. I'm taking some of the Cruciferous Crunch Trader Joe's salad mix. This salad mix has like kale, cabbage, red cabbage, Brussels sprouts, and all kinds of good nutritious greens in it. And then on top of that, I will be having some grape tomatoes, and then I will be placing some of the just grilled chicken strips from Trader Joe's on there for some protein. And finally, I'll be topping it off with the Trader Joe's cilantro dressing for a nice, low-calorie, healthy meal to end the day. So that is the finished product. You've seen all my snacks and meals for the day. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like it if you did and don't forget to subscribe.